Hey guys, I just wanted to play around with a new camera that I got and show you a bit of a, a little collection that I've owned for a while and that not a lot of people talk about. It's all the Nintendo 64 Grey Cart variants. Now, a lot of these 64 collectors have these and there's only 13 games to get so it's not that big. I actually have 15 games. I'm going to show you a couple that not a lot of people talk about or may even know about, but yeah, here it goes, playing around with a new camera. And I got a little N64 memorabilia. Oh, that's not even on frame. Yeah, there we go. I'm going to have to learn how to play with this. Okay, so here is all the games, starting in alphabetical order. You can see them on my dirty floor here. I didn't mind to clean up. Aiden Chronicles, the first mage, Army Men Com Air Combat. Army Men Sarge's Heroes 2. There were three Army Men games. They only opted on two of these as the variants. Bassmasters 2000, Hydro Thunder, Road Rash 64, Rugrats the Movie in Paris, Rugrats in Paris the Movie, Scooby Doo, Classic Creep Capers, Tom Clancy's Rainbow Six. Now this one here, most people won't consider it a variant. Um, the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. Now most of these games, the gray cart, it was released only as a second print run. Most of these games were released as a color cartridge first. Now this one here, this isn't the first and second print run. This is a collector's edition. So all of the Zelda Ocarina of Times are gray and then the collector's editions are gold. So that's not really a variant since uh, the rest of these are second print runs. This one's just literally a different box. I still consider it different because, well, there's a gray and a gold, so I consider it in this list. The um, 007 The World Is Not Enough, Turok 2, Seeds of Evil. Now here's another weird one, Turok Rage Wars. Now this gray cart was not a second print run. This version here actually has a glitch in it. So if you play in two player mode, you cannot get past, I think it's the third mission, even when you complete it, it will fail it every single time. So back in the day, if you emailed a claim and said, hey, there's a glitch wrong with this, and you sent in your game, they sent you back a great uh, copy with the fixed glitch. I have ordered two of these copies. It took me a while to get one. The first one I ordered actually was just a black version in a gray cartridge, so the glitch was still there. Uh, this took me a while. I had to play around with the girlfriend a bit to figure out if it was a real version, and sure enough, this one is, so I'm keeping this one. Now, this one here is another one that most people might not know about, but... It is WCW Backstage Assault. Most people know this is a blue cartridge game. This gray cartridge game, I don't know if you can see down here at the bottom. Let's see how good this camera zoom is. Um, this model number here, NUS, oh, I had it for a second. NUS006, uh, NWV MSA. You won't see the MSA on this one here. Um, now, I don't know if this means it was... Uh, Mexico or what but it was not released like that around here that I've seen um, I've seen three of these now in my years of collecting and not a lot of people talk about it I know two other collectors with one those aren't the three that I've seen I've actually seen three sold ones of these and then I know a few others that have these now the last one here most people might not even consider real let alone being gray Zelda Majora's Mask so most people consider this the more common one, the holographic label. And then this, the more uncommon one, just the regular sticker print. This here is a holographic label, which most people will say, oh, that's just a regular gold cart swapped out in a gray shell. Which I've seen those before, but this one looks too real. I've even picked it up for $60 at a store in Newfoundland, which is a small place, so maybe they had a second print run of these in gray. I've tried to do so many hours of research and all I can find is other people you know, thinking the same thing they have as me. They might have it, they might not. Other people say it's fake, and not a lot of people talk about it, but this here I've had for a number of years before repros were even big. And uh, yeah, this is the complete N64 gray cartridge, cartridge variant set. And yeah, just wanted to show you a bit of new stuff, play around with a new camera, and let's see how it looks.